reports as Congress debates whether to extend the extra unemployment benefits. The extra $600 a week in benefits for unemployed Americans expires next month. America is on the precipice of an eviction tsunami, particularly in the black community. House Democrats passed a bill last month to extend the benefits through January. Oregon Senator Ron Wyden is pushing for the Senate to do the same. And Wyden says he doesn't understand why Republicans are pushing back. Big corporations are getting trillions of dollars in support to weather this crisis. And now Senate Republicans are saying, well, we're just going to cut what the little guy gets. The Trump administration is against the extension. Our economy has turned the corner against the coronavirus. Secretary of Labor Eugene Scalia says in May, the unemployment rate dropped nearly one and a half percent. And Senate Republicans say that extending the extra $600 a week in benefits may do more harm than good. Most recipients are being paid more on the unemployment insurance than they were when working. Iowa Senator Chuck Grassley says letters from small business owners say some employers can't find people to hire. For $15 an hour, and we find that they're receiving equivalent of $20 an hour in unemployment benefits. Some lawmakers urge a compromise, tying the unemployment benefits to each state's unemployment rate. In Washington, Alexandra Limon, KCAU 9 News.